Well, Beverly Hills Chihuahua has been a big hit at the box office. Sure has. In fact, I think it's the number one movie. But local animal advocates have some concerns. Let's go live now to the K-Frog studios there in Colton. Frogmen Scott and Tommy here to explain. Guys, the dog's already popular, perhaps even more so with the movie. Yeah, yep. it's kind of a good news, bad news kind of thing. Uh, Beverly Hills Chihuahua, number one at the box office here in the Inland Empire as well. Pet rescuers say they are already overrun with abandoned chihuahuas uh, because of the stalled economy. And uh, well, these dogs have been kind of overexposed in the media the past few years. Now they're afraid that this new movie is going to be the equivalent of what one animal advocate described as another bank failure. Experts urge people who may be thinking about getting a chihuahua to adopt from a shelter mm -hmm. or rescue agency instead of the breeder stores or online ads. People who've already seen Beverly Hills Chihuahua say it may send a positive message about yeah. abandoned animals because the title character is homeless after being stolen in the yeah. movie. Both the canine leads in the movie were actually adopted by the film's animal trainer. Rusco is the male who plays Poppy in the movie. He was saved from the Moreno Valley Animal Shelter mm -hmm. in November of 2006. And if you guys remember back in the mid-90s when uh, Disney did the live-action version of 101 Dalmatians, a lot of people ran out and bought a Dalmatian because it was so cute. So many of those animals wound up in shelters, and animal rescue groups are afraid it's going to happen again. They're afraid, really, that people are going to think it would be really cute to have a mom and a dad mm -hmm. and have their own litter of puppies, <laughs> therefore adding even even more animals to the system that is already overloaded with chihuahuas. But again, some facts before you go out and do that. San Bernardino County Animal Care and Control says they've got 21 chihuahuas or chihuahua mixes in their shelter. Riverside County Department of Animal Services said on Monday there's 94 chihuahuas oh, or yeah. chihuahua mixes yep. in the county's four shelters. Now keep in mind they handle, Riverside County alone handles about 30,000 animals a year. A lot of those are euthanized. Probably about half of them are. So here's some things to think about with chihuahuas. They're a very high energy breed. They require a lot of attention and a big commitment. They can live a long time. Small dogs can yep. live as much as 20 years. And small little nervous dog can be biters mm -hmm. and, and, and mm -hmm. animal animal <laughs> groups remind you don't judge them on their looks or color because you think they're cute judge them on their temperament and we are very proud of our uh, inland empire resident poppy uh, from the moreno valley animal shelter but remember beverly hills chihuahua is a movie and if you're thinking about adopting folks could we encourage you maybe to go out and find a little frog to take home they they need homes and they don't bite okay really <laughs> happen to have those around the studio. Yeah, it's it's weird. Get all, uh, a few of these. <laughs> they get all upset. They taste just like chicken. I didn't hey. say that, guys. <laughs> That's wrong. All right. Thanks, guys.